Goldilocks wagi ni bwe mina kwedazit shpumsagok mbaugamgok. Wagi dagnan netum bargain. Zam wish kam get im bargain. Wagi dagnan nishom bargain. Zam no kyam get im bargain. Wagi dagnan so bargain. Mam kad gamak wunet oda bargain. Ilsa oda jo pi gim bewak o gigiagos. Goldilocks wagi ni bwe mina kwedazit shpum sagok nbao gumgok. Wagi dagnan netum bargain. Zam wish kam get im bargain. Wagi dagnan nishom bargain. Zam no kam get im bargain. Wagi dagnan so bargain. Mam kad gamak wunet oda bargain. Ilsa oda jo pi gim bewak o gigiagos. Goldilocks wagi ni bwe mina kwedazit shpum sagok nbao gumgok. Wagi dagnan netum bargain. Zam wish kam get im bargain. Wagi dagnan nishom bargain. Zam no kam get im bargain. Wagi dagnan so bargain. Mam kad gamak wunet oda bargain. Ilsa oda jo pi gim bewak o gigiagos. Goldilocks wagi ni bwe mina kwedazit shpum sagok nbao gumgok. Wagi ni bwe, she stood, mina, and kwedazit, to climb upstairs, this is in the conjunct form, shpum sagok, upstairs, literally somewhere above, nbao gamak is the bedroom, the gumgok is to that place. Ni bwe uh, will often use for stand, uh, or some use nibo, but literally it's more like stand in place. The zugui is more like rise. Wagi dagnan netum bagan. Dagnan is the verb to touch it. Dagna would be the verb to touch something or someone animate. Netum means first, and bagan is bed. Zam wishkazam get im bargain. Zam is too or too much of it. Wishkaze is strong or hard. Maget it is. E that. Mbagan bed. Ba is the verb to sleep. Gun is a thing. So whenever you see a gun at the end of a noun, it usually means the front part is a verb to do something. For example, botagen is a grinder or a mortar. Botage he or she grinds. Wagi dagnan nishom bagan. Wagi dagnan, she touches it. Nisho, second. Bagan, bed. Zam nokyam get im bagan. Zam means two. Nokya, it's soft. Nokze o wabozo, the rabbit is soft, that's the animate form of it. Nokya i. Peshmoen, the mattress is soft. Wagi dagnan sultanbagan. This one is the same as the previous one. She just touch she touches uh, the third bed. Wagi dagnan 
Mom card gemak wunet oder bargen. Mom card gemak. Wow, this is a woman's term. Wunet, it is good. Oder, this, something that's close by. Bargen, bed. Demonstratives are a way of talking about this and that. It depends if an object is animate or inanimate, if it's plural or single, and it also depends how close something is in proximity to you. In the animate form, in the singular, we have oder, this. Something real close. O, that, a little further away. Ago, that, like far away. And then the plural of the anima is goda, these. Gi, those, a little further away. And egi, those far away. With the inanimate ones, it's oda for this. E for that, something a little further away. Ei, that far away. And then the plural form of the inanimates is noda, these. Ni, those and any those far away. Ilsa odejo pi gimbewak o gigiagos. Ilsa, so, odejo pi, at this time. Gimbewak, she went to sleep. The walk is used in the third person by some older speakers and in older writings with some speakers. O, that gigagos little girl Goldilocks wagi ni bwe mina kwadazit spumsago mbao gumgok wagi dagnan netum bargain zam wish kam get im bargain Wagi dagnan nishom bargain. Zam nokyam get im bargain. Wagi dagnan so bargain. Mam kat gamak, win it or a bargain. Ilsa orjo pi gimbewak o gigagos.